guys, this is Dora Michelle from Makeup or Breakup Blog, and today I'm going to be trying out the Disney Villains Misunderstood palette from ColourPop. Loving the packaging and loving these colors. I just want you to see what they look like. I'm trying to get them. But I'm going to use Tragic for the base. I was so excited when this came out. I'm already loving because ColourPop is known for its pigmentation. It doesn't play around with that. I'm going to go in with Devious for the crease. I'm staring at this Forest of Thorns, which is a shimmer. And I'm not sure how it would look with a brush. I may need a firmer brush. But it's so pretty, so, so pretty. It does come off on the brush, which is nice. But again, you need a firm brush. And I'm just going in there right now. To see what it gives me. It gives me this very pretty, almost like a lilac, like a light lilac payoff, as well as some shimmer, which I am delighting, although I could go darker with this, but you see there is some shimmer, and of course there is a little bit of fallout, but no big deal. It's easily um, taken care of. <laughs> I also want to try this lovely, I'm just dying for this shade, I don't know what it is, it's called Diablo. Look at the color payoff on there. And I'm just gonna put it dead center. Why not? That is so pretty. I think I'm gonna work it to the inner corner. Just cuz. Wow. A little goes a long way with this. What else am I gonna try? I'm gonna try a little bit of the uh, Sing. And then we'll put that in the outer. It feels almost like butter the way it's coming right off. And this has like a purplish tinge to it. So I'm gonna put that at the far end. Wow, that's that's intense. So I'm actually gonna add that to the crease as well. <laughs> I was not expecting that to be so dark, but I'm not hating it. Of course I have to clean that up, but oh my gosh, that is gorgeous. So I'm gonna go back in there with the brush and see if I can blend it. Okay, so I went back in and I cleaned up a little under the lids. I'm loving it. I'm also feeling this blue. I've gotta have this blue. I don't know how I'm gonna put it on, but I'm gonna find one. So what do you think, guys? Look at this color. I'm like, I'm just like all over the place with it because I think I use almost everything in the palette. I'm feeling a little dramatic today. I think I'm gonna try in with this color just because it just it just looks so pretty. And I think I'm gonna use my finger and apply it. This color, oh, it's very chunky. It's called Sing. And I'm just gonna pat it on the lid. Oh my God. Take this fluffy Farrah brush and just go back in and this is just so damn sexy. So damn sexy. I could see going to a club with this and just dancing the night away with some gorgeous stranger <laughs> and just bewitching him with my charms, if that makes sense. <laughs> this is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. I, I, look at that. It's just so dramatic. And again, I'm just, whatever I apply there, I'm just spreading and blending, blending, blending. I'm not adding anything further, but look, look at that color. Beautiful. It's gorgeous. Now dead center, I want to put some of this bad boy, just cause 
but I don't know why. I mean, I could put this one in to make it more purpley, but I wanna do a little, let's just go crazy. This is a fun palette. This is not your everyday palette. So I'm just gonna put that right on the, wow, wow, wow. And I'm so sorry you're hearing a lot of hammering. It's just, like right on top of that, it's like, it's so strong. It could just take over the other color. That's okay. All right then. I mean, just like that. It's just, wow. Like, wow. I want to put some of this purple in. I don't know if I'm going to put it on the inside. And I'm just using my fingers. I'm not really. Um, maybe on the inside. Like, oh, that's pretty. Again, so sorry for all the noise that's going on upstairs. That is so, that's so pretty. And I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm like, wow, that's just so pretty. Wow. Like, I think I'm gonna use, and I didn't even put a base on. I just applied straight on. That, that's that's how that's how much. I think I'm gonna add this. This is this is tragic. One of the few mats that that's in there, and I'm just gonna. Oh, that's pretty. It just cleans up the top like so. Again, so sorry for the noise up there. Oh my goodness. What do you think of the finished look? I like it. Just look at those colors, my goodness. <laughs> I think this is one of the more fun ones. It kind of harkens back to what I've heard people say when ColourPop first came out, that they had more bold, interesting colors. I think this is a nod back to where ColourPop was when they debuted and why they stood out the way they did. Their formulas are fantastic. The color payoff is sublime. Thank you so much for joining me on my latest makeup adventure. This is Dawn Michelle from Makeup or Breakup Blog. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Hit that like button, and hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell so you will know my next video will be on. Thank you so much for watching and joining me on my latest colorful makeup adventure. And I will see you on the next video. Take care. Bye.